What's up everyone, Fred Nielsen here. This video is going to be a video on how you can make a really cool space effect, space text effect, in Adobe Photoshop CS4. This works with CS3 as well. I'm not sure about the previous versions, but that, or well, post a comment if you know about that. So, the, I got this from a website, there will be a link to that in the, in the description. And without further ado, let's get started with the video. So you're also going to need a picture of the background space, but that you can get from the website as well or, well, you can find one on your own. So let's go on File New, and we'll set the width of the document to 1280, and the height, you want to set it to 720. Make sure it's pixels, and RGB color mode, 8-bit or 32-bit, your choice for you. It doesn't really matter that much. So we're going to close this down, because we don't really need this anymore. And now we have the bl blank document. So write a text or something, every, every anything you want. I'll just write FF Comp help, FF, as that is my username. And then we want to set it to Arial Bull and 92 point. Or, well, you can set it to any to any font and any size, but it would be better if you have a a very thick font. So next up, just move it around as you wish and put it about in the center. So next, you're going to double click or well, you're going to right click the text effect layer. If you do not have it, on, if you don't have layer, go on Window and make sure layer is checked right here on layers. Then right click and say to blending options and click outer glow. So the first thing we're going to do is go in blend mode, set it to normal. We want to set the opacity to 100%, the color to black. I'll just zoom in. If you don't, if you can't really follow me, just uh, just pause this video, copy that into your document, play and continue. So the technique softer, or as it is by default, we want to set this to 30% and you want to set this size to 12 pixels and the range we will set it to a hundred percent and this is pretty much it this is how it looks it doesn't look very, very good yet but that is because we do not have the space document in yet so we're going to take the, the space document drag it in it can be anything you want or this is the one from the website so then put it in front of the document and what you're going to do now is right click the layer and go on create clipping mask and that's pretty much it. Now it looks very clean and you can easily see what the text says, not as it was before we put in this clipping mask. So that's pretty much it for today. This is FF Comp Help. Just comment, rate, subscribe, check out the, the website and made this the or made this tutorial if you want to follow that instead. Uh, comment rate sub, comment rate subscribe. Follow me on Twitter at twitter.com slash Fred Nielsen. Become a fan on Facebook, all of the links are in the description. And until next time, this is FF Comp Help and have a nice day.